Beautiful spot. Fish in the top part of the gorge. I haven't been at before. It's a fairly productive river. Holds some good fish in it. Yeah, I'm just walking downstream here. A bit of a slog to get down to where I need to. I'm still a fair way up from the river, as you can see. At least it's a fairly decent walkway. And it'll drop down the further we go. So I'm not going to go all the way to the bottom. The start of the gorge. I'm going to start halfway and work my way up. Should find some pretty productive water. There's good pools all the way up there, so we'll go back as about the midway point and drop down onto the river and hunt for some some nice brownies. Get the odd rainbow in here too, so been walking three quarters of an hour. So it takes a little while. It should be worth it in the end. Once I get down there, it's fairly overcast conditions. The water's pretty clear though. These type of rivers are easy enough to spot the fish anyway. It's not going to matter too much. I'll well, we'll keep walking for perhaps another half an hour or so and start fishing. Right, made it down to the river. Just have a breather for a couple of minutes. Drink of water, bite to eat, and uh, I'll get my rod set up. It's fairly low, but there's some good pools as I was walking around down the gorge. Yeah, I was having a good look over the side. A lot of good holding water. Got a fair bit of water to cover. I've walked a fair way down. Probably halfway down the gorge. So anyone that's coming up from the bottom end will we're leaving them enough water to fish. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a one just in there. Think about what I'll what fly I'm gonna use. I just moved up from that pool there. There's no fish down in that pool where I was sitting up. Initially thought there was, but pretty certain there's one in here. I think there might be two. There's one sort of just in that middle of that swirling current, quite deep. It's got a really heavy weighted nymph on. Got him. Good fish. He's taking the nymph. Don't want to keep him in here really. That log. started getting a bit more active. I've been sort of sitting here watching it for probably a good half an hour after I sort of peppered it for a while. Nothing was happening. There's two fish in here. This might be the slightly smaller one. Sort of reasonable size but there's another one in here that's a good size. I can keep them in here. Here we go. Down here would be something. Just steer him in here. He's nearly done. Goody. On the board. Tricky fish, these two. The two in there, they change different nymphs. They weren't really feeding that well when I first started, when I first seen them. So I kind of left them for half an hour, they're more or less lying 
doggo on the bottom. And then they started getting a bit more active in the last 10 minutes or so. Five pound. Not a bad fish. Five pound. A wee bit thin at the tail, but it's still a, a decent fish to open the account. There we go. I'll just rest there for a bit. No. Up towards the, the rocks there. Chill out now. Yeah, I've just got them on a tungsten bead. Size 16 pheasant tail. Under a blue bodied humpy for an indicator. Just because it's easier to see, they're not rising. Lovely piece of water in here. You've got to be surprised if there's not a fish in here. I'll scan the water carefully. Especially in this piece. So there will be a good chance for one just at the end of that, the head of that pool there. So far, nothing standing out. I get the feeling it won't be long though. Look at the water we're coming up against. A few likely spots around here. Let's put them on an emerger, like a, a dad's favourite emerger. Nice fish here rising. It's quite calm. So I don't want to put on a that big fly. So if I can just cast. Got him. Oh, nice. Rainbow. Oh, that was epic. First cast. rising hard out just as I was setting that fly up. Now we rainbow. Feisty fish as you expect with rainbows. Fish down there, there was a fish down there moving. I'm thinking. It's not the one. Where are we? Whoa, Jesus, beauty. Oh, this is where. This is where we gotta be careful. Don't we? Rocks. I'd rather have them down here to be honest. Get them away from all that. Nice fish though. Plenty of fight. Still got plenty in them. I do you get the, the odd rainbow in here? Mostly browns, but um. I do get a few here. He's speaking on the fish on this pole too, there's a couple I've just seen take off, but not much can do. Rainbows always have plenty of energy. Not done yet, that's for sure. Let's try and get him in here. Get into the sort of more or less beach him. Yeah. Want them in there? Bring them around, bring them around, bring them around, bring them around. Lovely 
lovely. Stunner. What a lovely fat fish. On the dry. Definitely the best rainbow I've caught from this stream. I'll take the fly out and go away. We got. Oh, what a stunner. Six pound. Beautiful. Six pound rainbow. Look at it. Look at the condition on it. Absolute stunner. Beauty. There you go. Great fight. Awesome. Hopefully we get some more action like that. Don't be too disappointed to find another rainbow or two. Fish still there. Sitting down deep. Where are is he? Oh yeah. Quite nice. We can get a cast in from here. It's a dry dropper, heavy weighted nymph. Oh good cast. It's gone over him. He might not be getting down deep enough. Could be the issue. It's pretty deep. Cast again, though. Got him. Nice. Oh, there we go. I was thinking about changing fly after the first three. Keep him in this pool again. Not going to get him up there. Nice. Draw a dropper. So a 16 tungsten bead nymph. Solid. You start here, mate. He hasn't really put up a big fight yet. Hmm. Oh, pretty average fight. Nice, definitely a big fish. Yeah, big fish, but yeah, I wouldn't say it was the best fight in the world, was it? Pretty much gave up the ghost straight away. Oh, he hit right on the end of his nose. Weigh them. Probably six, six pound. Have a look. And we're just on six. And fish following that rainbow. Beautiful colours on it, isn't it? Look at it. Second brownie. Him up here a bit. Get him back in his pool. Yeah. He's all right. He's all good now. Awesome. Great 
Yeah. 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 Wood sized fish feeding right in the middle of this pool here. I'm not sure if the drop is actually long enough, but I've got a heavy nymph on. I can probably get reasonably close to them actually, like as long as I stay low. Fish sitting pretty deep. You're sitting pretty deep in there. Get the line straightened out. Probably needs to go up further, but no, no. <laughs> Whoa. Is it two? Jeez. Well, there's your answer. Probably need to go up a bit further. And then next thing uh, see the dry go under. Not sure what's under there but Hmm. Don't know what's under there. Burrowed right in. There's a few rocks in there, in there, so hard to. Could have gone around. I think I can. He's still connected. I'm not sure. He hasn't snagged me. Oh, he's gone around the other side. Okay. It's all right. Oh, no. He's gone to the back of there. A cheeky bugger. I can't get down there. The rocks go in and around. He's gone around, I think. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> I could see him. Cheeky bugger. I'm gonna play him here like this. Easy. Yeah, I know. I'm not going in there. I'm just saying he's going back and forwards in, that, in and around that rock. He's come out a couple of times. I can't pity. I can't get down there. Damn it! Can't be much about it. I need to get back. I need to get him. Need him to get around from that rock there. Yeah, come back out, no. I can still feel him pulling, he's pulling in, he's still... I think I've still got him. Need him to get out of there. Whoa! <laughs> he just bolted out of there. Oh god. <laughs> I don't know why he came over here, he was fine where he was. Jesus! Oh, this again? Crazy. These rocks are a bit slipperier too.
Oh, he's coming back down, I think. It's going back up again. Things you do to catch fish. Madness. What a fight. Oh. Whoa. I'm not even still on. To be honest. These rocks are terrible. I've just got to stay connected to them. I'm right up high. Not all I can do. I can't net them out there. Where is he? Far out, man. He's gone down deep, man. He's not... God, he's got so much energy. He's almost like he's a rainbow. Where is he? Whatever you do, don't go back to those rocks. Hey? Oh, it's been told he's a rainbow. No surprise with the energy it's got. Do the second one, but job not job ain't done yet. Not so much to get him behind here, but I need to get him out here if I can. He's getting. You want to grab the net off me? No. Got him! Woo! What a fight! <sighs> Jesus, he took me everywhere. Oh, that's a great, good sized fish. Good sized fish. Because of the um, thickness, he'll be getting close to six again. Could be another six. Uh, probably more. Five and a half, five and a half pound, but the condition stunning. Five and a five and a half pound hen. Second rainbow for the day. We go for two brownies. Good fight. Something a lot better than that last fish. Good. There was another big one in that pool there, but he'd be gone now, wouldn't he? Well and truly. Let me go first. Hold that for a minute. <laughs> See what I'm doing? Suss some things out, you know. I'll just wait there for a minute. Let me work this out. Stay there. Feels a bit sketchy here, I don't reckon. Hey? I think so. That felt a bit freaky. Yeah, it felt like I was going to slide, eh? To be honest. Whew. Yeah, it didn't like that bit. Where are they actually? Where? It's nothing to lose, Cast. Sorry. 
Actually. All right, let's go. Where is he? I'm not far enough ahead of him, actually. Oh, he's moving over to that. Oh. oh he must have him. He come racing over to it, eh? Got him. Here we you go, mate. Oh, no, I got my sleeve caught. I'm sure he had two goes, eh? Yeah. Caught on the handle. That's how it broke off. That was a good fish. Well, that was the one shot. <laughs> 